do you sign off on your emails? Do you do sincerely, kind regards? If you're one of those folks who use the word best when ending your emails, you're doing it all wrong. Well, it turns out that more and more people are using the salutation, rendering it just about meaningless. Here now with the best way to sign off is Bloomberg News reporter Rebecca Greenfield. And Rebecca, you were telling us during the commercial break, you're getting a lot of feedback on this. What are people telling you? Yes, I am. Some people really appreciate it. They say, thank you. You've changed my life. I don't want to use a sign off anymore. And some people are really angry at me saying that they use best and they're not changing their endings. Uh, like me. I'm not angry at you. I'm just confused now. What do I do? Um, you can continue using best, but it's just meaningless and empty and can come off as short. And you don't have to do it. Just free yourself from best. Did she just call me meaningless and empty? <laughs> I, I, I didn't is, hear that my, at this all. This is my constant state of being. That's okay. okay. That's okay, best. <laughs> but what are some of the other ways that people are now signing off? People still use the traditional sign-offs, like sincerely and thanks, but all of them just have problems. So in my article, I kind of push for no sign-off, just end the email. Okay, tell us what we're seeing on the screen. You're ending your emails <laughs> wrong if you use these? Yeah, I think, I think thanks might be the best option, but only if you're actually thanking someone for something. <laughs> But okay, but, but so what if though, I mean, because people, some people do use email as a formal piece of communication, it's like a formal letter to mm -hmm. people. So what if you are doing that? What if you want to do this professionally, right? You want to send a letter to your boss, an email I to mean, your boss. I mean, use your judgment. Of course, context really helps with all of this. But I think that for a lot of cases, you'll see if you just think about it and rewrite the email in a way that ends with a thoughtful thought or a question, you don't need the ending. You sound professional. All right, Rebecca Greenfield. Wow, I don't know what to do now. Hey, I'm just, I'm just gonna text. You can see the whole story, <laughs> Bloomberg.com, and I'm. How does the story end? It ends with um, me. Best Rebecca. Best Rebecca. Yes. <laughs>